The primary intent of our proposal is to deliver a prefabricated and transportable design solution that is effectively cyclist and can be configured to suit the location as well as the operational needs of the user. The design also aims to tackle issues such as social isolation and urban blight by embedding circulation wells as an architectural intervention, encouraging community interaction by increasing the frequency of chance meetings. The design was conceived and developed through close cooperation with a keen team of engineers that scrutinized the design at every stage to ensure that the final product was buildable and compliant with the code. The iterative design process tested various materials and compared the test results to achieve a final product that was best amalgamation of sustainability and economic viability. The design focuses on flexibility in configuration to deliver a solution that can adapt to any given site and be optimized according to the user's needs. By incorporating a bolt-down modular base frame, the design can be configured as a single bedroom studio or two bedroom set on the same base platform. The cascading design also assimilates geometry and aesthetics projecting an identity that is unique and visually pleasing. Each prefabricated module comprises of a bolt-down steel frame screwed onto a precast concrete strip foundation. A grid of LVL floor joists forms the base of the structure floor on top of which the inner modules sit. The inner module is prefabricated and transported to site as a complete built unit. Innovative trusses for walls exoskeletal shell forms the main structural support of the modules, supporting the roof members of each module while allowing for ventilation around the inner module if needed. A perforated mesh operable facade is designed to be clipped onto the outward facing timber truss to act as a solar shade and allow for ventilation. Finally, the roof is overlaid with an engineered timber floor to serve as outdoor decking for the module above. The cascading building incorporates the use of passive design principles such as self-shading where each module casts a shadow on the module below it and passive ventilation through operable louvers and a wraparound veranda. The cleverly stacked modules create spaces underneath of varying heights to allow for circulation wells to encourage community interaction through chance meetings and visual contact. Internally, the exposed trusses, beams and concrete also support the design principle of permeable architecture where materials are exposed to reveal their natural form and fibers, helping bridge the connection between the built environment and the natural world. The rectangular shape of the modules projected as a landscape viewing instrument offering a different view of the surroundings at every level through a forced perspective. Custom-made perforated mesh louvers are designed to be attached to the exterior timber truss of each module. These operable louvers serve as solar shade while helping to channel airflow into the wraparound veranda to aid with passive cooling through ventilation. An essential part of the design process was to encourage adaptive reuse and LCA analysis of the building using a comparative study pattern. A heritage listed existing warehouse on the site was incorporated into the design and repurposed as student accommodation, demonstrating adaptive reuse. The finished design of a single module was analyzed using full steel, full timber and hybrid construction to achieve 41% saving in greenhouse gas emissions. This data, which incorporates the end-of-life use of bolt-down construction helps support the claim of circular economy for the building. Overall, this proposal endeavors to express the benefits of modular, prefabricated drywall construction techniques which involve off-site construction of modules and delivery to site as complete built units or flat pack systems. Modular prefabrication has been documented to improve efficiency predictability of construction and worker safety, whilst reducing construction costs, 
incurred through disruption and material waste, making the project more economical than traditional building methods. Thank you.